What's up YouTube? It's the Shepherd family again. Today we're going to cook spaghetti, but we're not going to cook it in any way. Matthew, that's being silly, that he wants to participate in the cooking. So he's going to start off and then after a while I'm going to take over. Okay, so. Okay. Now I'm, he cooks his breakfast in the morning. Um, he makes eggs, bacon, and sometimes sausages. And he makes... um waffles whenever he feels like making the waffles so what we're gonna do with this right here is we're gonna turn it down a little bit and then the next thing we're gonna do is put some butter in the pan Okay, so we put all the sausages in. Um, Matthew now is gonna take the spoon and he's gonna flip them over. I wanna show you, for those who, doesn't, who do not know how to um, do these sausages, if you can see, they cook fairly um, fast. They're good if I say so myself. And then what we do, y'all, is after we cook them like that, um, and we chop these up. We're going to chop them up like this. Once we do that, we're going to put it right back. You can see it still has pink in it. And let me see if you can see it. have to make sure all the pink is gone. And you have to do it on every side. You see that? Uh-huh. And you got to keep an eye on it because you don't want to burn it. See that I got pink on it? Right here? Yeah. So you flip it over because you want it to cook thoroughly the same way. Okay. And you leave it alone. These might be, these might cook faster. Yeah, it looks like they're the Yeah, side. because they're smaller so it, it doesn't take that long for them to cook. You just got to make sure to cook them. You don't want to cook them till they're burnt. You want to cook them till they cook thoroughly. Like crispy. No, not till crisp either because that's burnt. Remember, we're going to put this in the spaghetti. Okay. And the spaghetti pot is right here. For those of you who want to know, Matthew's 10 years old. He never cooked without supervision. He always cooked with some supervision. <laughs> He <laughs> don't want anybody to know. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. I cook eggs and I know how to cook bacon. Yeah, but I'm not saying that you don't know how to cook. I'm saying we're always in the kitchen with you while you cook. So for the sauce, we're going to do this. Let me see. Yep, flip them around. Do it how I taught you to do it. Oh. Which hand is more comfortable for you? This one. The one I'm doing right now. You look like you're struggling. Yeah, because I never flipped things like these before. So it's my first, since it's my first time, it's kind of difficult. Okay, and these are done. Y'all see? They're done. And you get that? So we're going to pull these out and move these over. Ground um, sirloin. So what we're going to do is I'm going to have him do this. And I'm supervising him again. He's just going to do this. And listen up. Right, Matthew? Yep. All right. When I tell you to change, all you got to do is, when I tell you to turn it over, you take your time so you don't make a mess. Oh, okay. okay? You want to try it? Here, try. Not fast, because if you do it too fast, then... Right, and then you bring this down like this. Watch your hands so I don't burn you. 
right? Yeah. And you do the same over here. If you have to switch hands, you move this over like this. You're going too fast. When you go too fast, that's how you spill things. You see? Yeah. You don't have to go fast. And you let it cook from that side. Here you go. Just leave it like that for now. Now, like I said, these over here, they were cut small. So now I'm going to cut these like that. Alright guys, so now we got the pot of water boiling or trying to boil on um, the stove. The beef we finished. Matt, open that beef and be careful so you can see it guys. That's done. Okay, close it back up. Oop, it's leaking a little bit of water. Yeah, okay. So now we're going to um, do the water. Um, here goes, uh, we put butter, but you can put oil if you want. And But I'm going to teach him to put it with butter. And we're going to do two bags of spaghetti. Here, put the butter in there. Just drop it in there. Yeah, just drop it in there. Okay. And now, let's show them this. These are the packets of, watch your hands, watch your hands so you don't get burned. These are the packets that we're going to use. You can get them from Walmart. We get, um, I think it's called the four pack. But we're going to use two of these packets because, it, again, we have a family of five. Um, we eat through all of, well, mostly the kids. Especially Matthew because he loves it. And Amina too. They eat through a whole packet. So I do two so it can last us for two days. And sometimes it lasts us for three days. Depending if they like it or they want to eat it or whatever the situation may be. Okay. So that's in. We're going to put some salt in there. That's a lot of salt. It's going to be alright. He says a lot, but trust me, it's not. <laughs> so, Eddie is done um, in the pot. And. It should be done according to the box. It says it should be done in about 8 to 10 minutes. Alright guys, so check it out. I won't let Matthew do it because the pan is too far back. I don't want him to get burned. Here goes the vegetables. You can also, for this, you can also use oil. You don't have to use butter. I usually use oil. But today I want it to be different. Um, the difference between the oil and the butter is just, I, I, I guess it would be the taste because I don't see too much difference um, unless you're talking about how it cooks. Um, when it comes to the oil, I just let it heat up a little bit and I want it to get hot because I want it to make, you see the sizzling sound it made when I put this in, I want it to be like really, really loud when I do the oil, but it's not necessary. And it's starting to smell good up in here because of these uh, vegetables and the garlic. And the noodles in that chicken. The noodles don't smell nothing. Oh, the beef you mean? Yeah. Yeah. This is a pretty simple meal as well. And we're gonna add the sauce. Not yet. I pick up the noodles and I go like this because I want to make sure each noodle um, is cooked good and then we're going to drain the water in a little drainer sometimes I go like this 
sometimes I just move it around. But this looks like it's going to be more than enough. When you um, make fresh garlic like this, do keep in mind, do not burn the garlic. Do not burn the garlic. I'm going to say it three times. Do not burn the garlic. Because if you burn the garlic, it's going to mess up everything. The flavor of burnt garlic is not good at all. So please, do not burn the garlic. So now it comes to the time that we're going to put the meat in there. Let's put the meat in there. And be careful because this is hot. And if you let it, it'll take over. And it will just throw itself out of the um, saute pan. Throw that in there. I'm going to mix this up. Um, I think I'm going to change the location of this pot. I'll be back. guys so I just switch everything about because I just needed it for convenience it's gonna be too difficult the way it was and this is perfect let's mix this up again Matthew done left me to do the cooking again he was supposed to help me but he didn't <laughs> Okay, we're going to put the sausages back in. Now we chose not to use pork in this house. I don't like it. It doesn't work on my stomach. My husband, it doesn't work on his stomach either. And so, um, before we had our kids, since we both didn't eat pork, that's what happened. It's just a family that don't eat pork. Okay, so the turkey sausage is mixed in well. So now what we're going to do is we're going to add the sauce little by little. Clean up my mess a little bit. A little bit clean. It's a little bit too high. Check on that noodle a little bit more. Matthew, you just keep kicking me to the curb. <laughs> I think this is done, Matthew. Yep, yeah, I think this is done now. It's done, y'all. It's done. So we're going to turn this off and we're going to strain this. Let me put a little bit of um, sauce in there, in this pot, just a little bit for now so I could just mix up the stuff. That's a lot of stuff. You think that's a lot, Matthew? Yeah, that's a lot. How we go up to put a foot in the noodles? Trust me, son. It's not. <laughs> Watch. Did I turn this down some? I sure did. 
I like how it gets quiet so when you start mixing. Yeah, because the sauce is a little bit cooler than what's in the pot. Mm. So it um stops the sizzling. Okay, so now some people they like it at this consistency. Okay? Oh, I made a mess. And other people they want some more sauce. It all depends on what you want. So let me bring it to you so you can see. This is the consistency. It doesn't have too much sauce. Some people like it like this, other people don't. Me, really and truly, that's the deer in the background. Say hi. Hi. She's getting some water. <laughs> what are you doing? Matthew's still here. I'm happy that I get to play the game off right. That's all they think about is game, right? She's <laughs> the one who stole the game from me. She did. How yeah. she stole the game she from me? She stole it because when I when when I would play on Friday after I finished school, she comes out of nowhere and be like, "Boom! I'm getting on this game." Be, 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 be. I be like, "Come on, man!" <laughs> I'm not gonna confirm nor deny that. Yes, yes you will. Be quiet. She beats him to the punchline very uh, often. And very often, she beats him to the punchline. She give him a taste of his own medicine. What yeah, medicine? Yeah, I don't get a taste of his medicine. <laughs> Okay, so back to cooking. <laughs> so, some people like it like this, some people don't. Let me strain the noodles and I'll be right back. Alright guys, so here we go. Um, I got the noodles strained, and now I put the rest of the sauce in there, and let's see this, get it to go down. Oops, kind of making a mess that I don't need to make. So if you're doing it like me, and it's in a small pot, and we don't have any more bigger pots, um, you're just gonna take it little by little. This should be good enough. And now I'm gonna add some seasonings. And all these seasonings that I'm gonna put in this is always to taste. So you do it how you how much you want. Matthew's over here licking his fingers. <laughs> or his lips, should I say. So here goes the noodles, they're done. Yes. Um I'm going to put Well, there's no more it left in there. But let me show you my little recipe. So, we're going to put. We're going to put adobo in this. And you only put a little bit of love everything. Because remember the sauce has enough on it. Excuse me. We're going to do that. We're going to put some garlic powder. Because I love garlic. Onion powder. Let me see. Okay, I switched it for this one. Garlic and parsley. Too much garlic is not enough. <laughs> just a little bit. Just to give it some flavor. Some thyme. These are dry. I prefer the um the real ones, but you know, quick and easy too. It's just as good. Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, 
I'm going to put this. Let me let you have a close up because this is what I need. Sazon con azafron. Let me see. Hopefully, y'all can see that. One packet. Oh, I didn't put the onion powder. Let me. Okay, this is onion. This is the open one. I had a um, I showed you the cold one, but this is the open one. Why is the sauce popping up? Because it's boiling, sir. And then we're gonna have this. Now, with this, you gotta be careful because it's super, super, super salty. So you don't need a whole packet. Maybe half. If that. And that's not even. See? Uh -huh. It's still there. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, you see how Matthew keeps coming in and out? I don't yeah, know if you saw I, him. I think that. I think somebody calling me every time. <laughs> Is your name John? No. So no, why would fine. it be in there? <laughs> Son, you're so funny. Is that Scarecrow trying to do a dance? No, that's just what they do, son. Now it's time to taste it. So, let's ask the guinea pig to taste it. I'm not no guinea pig. <laughs> no? No, I ain't no guinea pig. Well, here, try it. Sir. <laughs> Blow it and try it. Let me see if they can see you. Come on over here a little bit so they can see you. No, move. I don't like it over here because I don't want you to get burnt. Come on over here. Here you go. It's hot. It's good. It's good? It's good.